My name is Eckehardt, the German butcher. Today I want to talk about salt. I heard so many times question about that. Is one salt stronger than the other? So I want to answer those questions today. First I have here, you can see my arrow, yes, that is Cure 1, not mixed. Then we have regular Morton table salt. Everybody knows what that is. Then I have two different kinds of sea salt. Kosher salt. Like this. And tender quick. And at the end I have uh, regular salt pre-mixed with uh, Cure 1. Since I wanted to know what is what, I made my own test. First I called the computer and asked how much weighs one tablespoon salt. The computer says 18 gram. So I took my powder scale and weighed a Morton salt. As you see here, it weighs 20 grams. And I weighed on each one at least five times. So and if you take a quarter cup, it's 80 grams. Now we will go to the sea salt, weighs only 17 grams. And as a quarter cup, 72 grams. Kosher salt, a tablespoon weighs only 16 grams. And uh, a quarter cup, only 68 grams. And uh, Morton Tender Quick is only 15 gram. And only 50 gram at a quarter cup. Now we come to test number two. I took 1000 gram water and 100 gram salt. That means 10%. And I mixed it up very good. And then I tested that with a brine tester. It looks like this. And I came up with 9% only, not 10%. So now I went to kosher salt. It also showed 9%. But by weight, it's very important to know. I weighed 100 gram, not by a, a cup or so. Then we came to sea salt. I was surprised. The same. That means the strength of the salt is in all the same if you go by weight. Except the Morton Tender Quick, there was only 7.5%. Because the, the cure is already in. But the cure not so much, but they have some sugar in it. That's why it shows a little bit less. So what did we learn from this, or what did I learn from that? I use only regular salt, but if I want to use any other salt, uh, sea salt or kosher salt, you just go by weight and you have no problems. Now I want to go to cure number one, or tender quick. Cure number one, you have to add salt to it. That means you should have only approximately one gram per pound sausage of uh, cure number one in it. Now if you go to tender quick, there's everything in already. You use it like regular salt. That means you don't have to worry about mixing or anything. When you use tender quick, that's it. No cure anymore. 